Hey everybody! It is just me today. If you've been watching our channel for a while, you know the K and E stands for Kim and Aaron. But Kim is missing for this trip. But I'm here at the campsites at Fort Wilderness at Disney World. So excited. Gonna be here for a few days with some friends. Here to check out all of the Halloween decorations. It's a very serious thing that happens here. The displays are incredible. People come, take their time, their money, and set up these extravagant, amazing Halloween decorations. I'm so excited to check it out. So for the next couple days, this will be my home. Fort Wilderness, the campsites at Disney World. It's an amazing, amazing campground that is on Disney property, so you do get all the benefits of staying at a Disney resort, but camping style. This is the um, check-in parking lot. Got a beautiful little sunrise in the back, but I will be here for the next few days. Kim is not joining me. For those of you who are familiar with our channel, have been hanging out for a while, Kim will not be with me on this trip, but I will be um, staying here with a few friends. So we are tent camping, and we're here to check out the Halloween decorations. I am so excited. So stay tuned. We're going to have some fun, make some food hopefully by the campsites and then check out some amazing Halloween decorations. That's a big deal here. They do um, Halloween go all out and Christmas as well. You can rent golf carts. They have um, horse riding stables which are great back here. There's a couple pools. You can do kayaking, all kinds of fun things. So this is definitely an awesome resort if you've never checked it out, even if you're not staying here. If they do have golf carts available, you can rent them and just drive around and look at all of the awesome decorations. All right, let's get into it. We are Kim and Aaron, and this is Zach and Cody. We are best friends living and traveling full time in our renovated RV, Lucy. We have been on the road since October 2020, so please subscribe to join in on all the fun. RVTV, K and E RVTV, sing it with us. Good morning, everybody. We got some breakfast going on here at our campsite at Fort Wilderness Campgrounds at Disney. Bacon smells amazing. We're gonna head to studios today. Say hi. 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 We're excited. Breakfast is always good when you're cooking outside. Lisa's my favorite. Christina's painting her nails for us. <laughs> <laughs> Scott's um, restocking the coolers with some ice. Here at the campground, they do have um, a few stores where you can get things you need. We just went and bought some bacon. It was $15, just so you know. You're gonna pay premium prices for anything you purchase at the stores. But yeah, we're gonna. I'm gonna make some breakfast quesadillas this morning. We've got some giant tortillas. We do some eggs and cheese, some sausage. So I'm excited. Who's hungry? Anybody hungry yet? Me. Yum. All right, so I got my bacon and sausage cooked up. So now I'm just finishing up the eggs for the quesadillas. I'm trying not to lose them in the hole in the skillet. But um, they are, there's electricity at every site here. So you can bring pretty much any appliance that you want, basically, to bring with you, what you want to cook. Christina brought a toaster, so we had some bagels yesterday morning. I'm excited for breakfast. I think it's gonna be yummy. Look at the size of these things. Yeah. <laughs> They're huge. We're making monster quesadillas. Grande. <laughs> and we have the best sauce topping over here. All right, look at these cute little packets. Talk about the sauce. And they say besties on them. Right. Love it, besties. <laughs> can't wait. I can't wait for your breakfast, Aaron. Woo! It's a little hot though. Yeah. It's okay, I could take a little cooler temperature, but hey. You know warming what? up. It's not raining yet. <laughs> But so I did the layer of cheese, the sausage, eggs, bacon. Christina and I added tomatoes and then we drizzled some of that Taco Bell sauce on top. And we're ready to roll. I'm excited. It's so hot now though. So we're gonna eat and let you know how it is. So breakfast was delicious. I'm trying to finish my second piece because those quesadillas were huge. But we're starting to get ready for our day. It's super hot. It's been cool at night. We've been lucky sleeping in the tents. This is our little setup. This is my tent right here. And then Scott and Christina are staying in the line. Hi, Scott! Staying in a larger tent over there. We have a lot of fun decorations set up. So I will show you them at night. It's a great tailgating tent too with lights all around it. Christina brought her golf cart. Yeah, so we'll be checking out some of the decorations here at the fort tonight. 
people go crazy with decorations here for Halloween and for Christmas. So I'm so excited to show you guys. I wish Kim was here so she could check it out, but she'll be editing this video so she'll get to see everything. So it's like she's here. We miss you, Kim. All right, guys, I have to show you our campsite with our cute little decorations that we have going on. I must say, I cannot take credit for any of this. This is all Scott and Christina's doing, but it's super cute. So we have our little table out here with treats for the golf carts driving by. You can grab a tree or anybody walking by. And then we start off in the little graveyard. Super cute. This resort is so fun for the holidays. Everybody goes all out for Halloween and Christmas. There's our little picnic table. Got some cute little tea light, little lanterns over here. And then every spot does have a charcoal grill. I know it's hard to see because it's dark, but I wanted to make sure that it was dark enough that you could see all the lights. Awesome tailgating little tent here with lights all around. And then the fun is really over here. This is the table of fun with, you know, the adult beverages and still some really fun decorations. Hello, Mr. Jack o Lantern, you're gorgeous. We do have a fan out here. It's actually not super hot in Florida tonight. It's, it's quite comfortable, but the fan does make a big difference. Here's Christina's golf cart she brought just for this trip. But yeah, I mean, we're having the best time. Fort Wilderness is definitely, if you enjoy camping, or maybe if you don't even know about camping, this could be your, a great spot for you to come for your first time because they do have electricity. So you can run, you know, extension cords to have whatever electricity you want. This morning we made breakfast on an electric skillet, which is super easy. And I would love, I'm gonna have to show you tomorrow because it's too dark right now. But Christina hooked us up with, <laughs> A faucet, shower, sink situation over here. There's a hose hanging in this tree. You can't see it. Oh, there we go. Perfect. Thank you, Christina. She took this hose. <laughs> the best thing about camping is you use what you have available. So she took the hose and wrapped it around this tree that looks like a pineapple. So we have water comes out right there. Oh, you going to do it? Yes. Show the, show the tube. There we go. Perfect. We wash dishes right here. You can wash your hands, brush your teeth. Like... You just got to be a little a little ingenuity when you're camping, but you can use your surroundings. But Christina is probably kind of a genius. She's pretty smart. <laughs> just a little bit, sometimes. Yeah. But yeah, the spots here are amazing. The people are amazing. Always good vibes. So we're so excited. We're going to drive around in the golf cart in a little bit and check out all of the Halloween decorations that are going on in the park. Did you get yourself? So excited. Yeah. Everybody Hi, everybody. See you too. So this is the K to the E and RV TV for this trip. Because Kim is not here. But Christina <laughs> spells her name with a K. So she's she's the K. The I'm e. not as good as the original, but you know, you get what you get. <laughs> and, and you, you don't, don't get, get upset. upset. <laughs> everybody, we're headed out on the golf cart to go check out some Halloween decorations. Scott is driving. Say hi Scott. They haven't What's seen you up? yet. Scott's you amazing, doing? yes. But we're gonna go check out these decorations. I'm so excited to show everybody. Super cute, super fun. They got treats. They do some kind of, what is it, a uh, parade of golf carts on Sunday, I think is happening, right? Yes. And what else? There was some kind of booze crawl there's they're a, doing? There's a uh, beer crawl beer. on Saturday. And for that's the adults. for the that's adults only. basically trick or treating for adults. I love it, love it. This is such a good vibe here, but we're excited. So we're gonna bring you along, so. Yeah, thanks for hanging out. First stop, we got Ursula. She's so creepy. <laughs> Jack Skellington and Sally. So cute. Love it. We're pulling up to this pumpkin display. Holy business. So cool. It's it's like Look at this. And they put little um, vinyl decals on it with all the characters. Hand drawn and painted. Wow, painted. Oh my gosh, that is so cool. That is cool. Very cool. I love it. And like how engine, how nice jugs, beautiful, man. nice jugs. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna get a close up because this oh, is so like cool. So amazing, beautiful. hand painted, so cool. Look, I love the Mickey silhouette with the castle inside, but like literally, there's like every character here. She hands paints them, so cool. Especially reusing the jugs, like so eco-friendly. 
and gorgeous. You get the flag. Love it. Where? Right there. Oh. It's not all. It's funny. We can forecast camping with a chance of, with a chance of drinking. The chances are high. Very high. We might have a cooler on the golf cart full <laughs> of adult beverages. <laughs> I don't know, but anyway. Oh yeah, let's get a better shot of the golf cart. Hold on, give me a second. So she's got little jack-o'-lanterns hanging around the top. We have a couple ghosts going on. Skeleton, I named him. This is Charles. Say hello, Charles. Hey, He's had a good <laughs> He's had a good time with us. But yeah, all right, on to the next. First of all, they already have a super cool projection right here with this witch. She's singing to us, she's casting spells. There's another group of witches here with their their little pot. They're making potions. Probably making some curses or something going on. They're a little creepy. But I have to show you this animatronic that's right here. It's so cool. Look at this. Look at this guy. What? What? So amazing. And then they have a whole little graveyard right over here too. Look, there's a hidden Mickey. <laughs> So cool. Look at this guy over here. He's tending to the graveyard. This is amazing. And people do this their own their own money, their own time, just so everybody can drive by and enjoy it. It's it's literally amazing. Check out this guy. He's trying to escape his grave. Oh my goodness. And his dog is faithfully waiting for him. Probably a little demonic, but it's cute. He's got the keys. <laughs> He's got the keys. Oh! That's what he's reaching for. He's I love it. A, a theme. We love a theme here in Disney World, right, Scott? That's right. It's all we about, love Scott. Scott ain't too hottie. All about the themes. Scott knows everything about Fort Wilderness, so everything you need to I'm gonna. Know. He's gonna fill me in on some information for y'all. So stay tuned. The inflatable game here at campsites at Fort Wilderness is incredible. People are not playing around. Look at this guy. He's huge. Huge. And then there's all. The graphics on the trees looks amazing. Oh my god, I don't know how I feel about this zombie baby. He a little, he a little creepy, a little uncomfortable. It's so cool. Love Mickey over the ear. Of course, everybody's gotta have a Mickey. <gasps> Holy crap, I see a giant skeleton over here. Part of my language. Pretty cool. Look at this guy, he's huge. Oh my gosh. How how many feet tall is this guy? I don't even know. He's humongous. And then look at the eyes. Oh my god, I'm gonna zoom in. Oh my goodness. I feel like he can see into my soul. We've hit some more inflatables over here. This, the time that it takes to do this. And like, people do it and they go above and beyond. It's incredible. And you can come to Fort Wilderness if there are golf carts available, even if you aren't staying on property. You can rent a golf cart and drive around and check out the campsites. Especially during Halloween and Christmas is super special. Look at this spider web. So cool. Check out this display right here. It's so cool. A little creepy. Dumb dumb. <laughs> no joke, I swear. Hi. You're spooky. So cute. And then a, a lot of people have their little bowl set up with um, treats, like we were saying before at our site. And you just drive by, grab a treat. It's really a, a good time. All right, so this is one of my favorite displays. It's so cool. We got Dracula, Beetlejuice, Frankenstein, the mummy, even, <laughs> he's a little spooky over there. But it's so cool with the black light. It's the Dracula puppet. <laughs> yeah. Oh yeah, I forgot about the bat flying around up here. This little demon bat guy. Yeah, so cool. And they even have a little projection over here with some spooky graphics going on. Oh my gosh, he's gonna take his eyeballs out. Oh, he sure did. He sure did. And you laugh. Okay. Bye. Got some hitchhiking ghosts over here. Oh wow, they're having a party on a golf cart. 
Oh, memento mori. Ah, uh, there's still people setting up. Like these are black tents, but there's gonna be something wild going on here. I'm excited. Like a haunted mansion theme. Hello. Hi. She's working hard. Yeah. <laughs> uh, I can't wait to see. I can't wait to see. Maybe tomorrow. Okay. okay. All right. We'll All right. Be we'll back. be. We will be back. But this is like so fun. Where? Oh wow. He. Oh my God. It's gonna be a haunted mansion. Everything. This is so wow. cool. Dear There's sweet a great Loretta, stone back beloved there. by all. And regions beyond now, but have having a ball. You get it, Loretta. Mickey Mouse. Cargo cat. <laughs> Who? Cargo cat. <laughs> Scott loves Donald Duck, and he can do quite the impression. Right here, they're setting up. I'm pretty sure it's gonna be some kind of haunted blockbuster or something. But like, I'm already impressed. They're not even done yet. And look, like look inside. That looks like a blockbuster in there. They have the DVDs set up. I'm so excited. Even like a little counter. Are you kidding? Are you kidding? <laughs> and a lot of people too have their golf carts decorated. Even more extreme. Oh, meter golf cart. It's hard to see because it's dark. But like this is so fun. It is. It's the funnest thing ever. <laughs> Especially you know if you really enjoy having a couple cocktails, driving around, checking out some decorations. This is the spot to do it. For those of you who have been watching our channel, you know that we love Bucky's. And here for Halloween, they have a Bucky's in his little Santa costume. Super cute. Like Scott said, nothing says Halloween like Bucky in a Santa costume. <laughs> but super cute. I love it. Love it. Thanks, Bucky's. We love your snacks and your brisket. So this loop we are on is Scott's family's loop. They come here every year. They've been doing it for years. They set up a great display as well. So I'm excited to show you guys how amazing it is. Not just their side either, all these sides. Yeah, this, this loop is a good loop. So I don't know if you can see everything so clearly because it is dark and there's some fog, but this is amazing. This is um, the neighbors next door to Scott's parents' site. They were actually neighbors last year as well, so they've made good friends, but look at this this guy. He is, how many feet do you think this guy is? What do you think? Over 20. Right, at least. He's huge. Huge, so creepy. And again, he's got those eyes. So, like I don't even understand like how people have this, this sense of design and just knowing what to do with these things. This is a big werewolf guy. He was moving earlier today, so maybe he's taking a break right now. But he's also huge. I know I keep repeating myself, but everything just blows my mind. All right, we got the Pumpkin King over here. He's amazing. Wow. Incredible. And they have their whole yard just full. This guy I really love. He's in his little Viking boat, taking souls down to hell, I guess. And this little girl is terrifying. I thought it was a person, I swear to you. I thought this was a real person, a real child riding her horse, but it is an animatronic. Super creepy. And her eyes are glowing. I saw her during the day, and now she's way more terrifying at night. All right, a lot of these animatronics are talking and spooking, so I don't know if you can hear me. But first of all, Scott's um, family, they're staying here in their classy RV. So if you follow us, you know we love RVs, and that's why we love our wilderness. Definitely we love camping. But look at this setup with the graphics and the pumpkin. So cool. And this is Daphne. Say hi, Daphne. Say hi to everybody. She's a sweet girl. Oh, oh, you're, you're alive now? Okay. He's really cool, too. This guy, he's tried to smack me in the face a couple times. We'll see if he'll come alive for y'all. Just give it a minute. He's super spooky. Oh my gosh. He's even terrifying looking during the day. But at night, he's extra creepy. Oh. He hasn't moved yet. Oh, here he goes. It's gonna, oh! Oh my gosh. Yeah, 
He, he's, he's a little terrifying. This guy too. He's posing for um, Swimsuit Magazine. Got the leg bag. And again with the creepy eyes. Technology is pretty amazing, isn't it? Have you had a rough day? You're just relaxing? Okay. I like it. And this is Scott's parents' golf cart. So cute. I love the eyes in the front. We got a little skeleton down here as well. And then, of course, the lights everywhere. We love the lights. I love that Halloween now gets their own lights, too, with the purple and the orange. They have little ghosts and skeleton lights on the top. And like we've seen some really impressive golf cart golf carts decorated here, like impressive. It's really hard to see at night, but this is Ryan. This is Scott's brother, and he was the vision behind their site here with all these awesome decorations. You, you have a skill, sir. Thank you. How long did this take you? Uh, about half a day, probably. Half a day. Yeah. Totally. Impressive. You've done an amazing job. Thank Love you. it. Love <laughs> it. Thank you. Still further trying to get out the of here. The top hundred is a real cool. Yeah, we did too. Super creepy. I don't know why little kids are the scariest things ever. And she's moving on her own. And this one still is the freakiest thing I've ever seen in my life. This spot is pretty incredible. We don't even know how they get to their camper that's back there because it is just full. They have a little graveyard over there. This giant, I guess it's kind of a jack back there with the top hat on. He's yeah. huge. What is he, 30 feet? Yeah. And then another skeleton, 20 feet. Like, this is really impressive. That is some, some hard work went into this and we are appreciating it. We got this witch over here. She moves her limbs and everything. Ugh, so cool. Some of these loops are like, every, almost every other RV has like a display going on. It is so cool. Wow. Gorgeous, look at the pumpkins. Oh my God. And we've seen quite a few of these inflatables with the, the traveling ghosts. Ooh, we got spooky football players over Hitchhiking here. Hitchhiking ghosts. I don't know what they smoking, but. <laughs> That's cool. I love the skeletons, they have mini ears on. Super cute. You could literally spend your whole time here just looking at decorations. And the fireworks are going off at Magic Kingdom. All right, y'all. I could film every single display here and it would be a 10 hour long video. But I think I'm gonna end it here. This is the Storm Trooper Galore. They all have costumes on. It is incredible. Wow. Oh, we got some Yodas down here too. This is nuts. I, I couldn't even count how many they have. Oh, I love the Mickey and Minnie too. So cute. But there's literally rows and rows of stormtroopers. We have some in dresses, some in pajamas, little pumpkin guys in pajamas. This is amazing. I love the witch hats. And of course we have the giant Mickey pumpkin, which we've seen almost every site has this pumpkin. <laughs> but there's two sides. There's more over here. Amazing. And it's crazy. People have trailers that they bring down just full of their decorations, park them at the front of the resort, and then spend, you know, hours upon days setting up these displays. It's incredible. I'm gonna try to get a front shot if I can, because it's worth it. 
These people so stay here the whole second half of the year. These these people with the stormtroopers? Yes. That's and crazy. And then they dress them up. So for Halloween, they'll dress them up for Halloween. They take it all off and then they dress them up for Christmas. Last year, they had them dressed up as Frozen characters. Oh my God. Anna, Elsa. That's amazing. Um, just all the characters from Frozen. So they'll change them up all the time. And that's so cool. And they basically just live here. I, that's the goals, like for real. If I could, if me and Kim were rich, I would live at Fort Wilderness for sure. But yeah, there's two separate displays of all of them. It's so cool. So with that, we will see you tomorrow. I think we're gonna head to Magic Kingdom, right, Christina? Yep, you ready? Magic Kingdom, let's Magic do it. Kingdom, let's go. See you tomorrow, hey, guys. It is the next morning. I hope you all enjoyed checking out the Halloween lights with us. We had such a great time. So impressed by the displays that are here. People spending their own time and money to create these these beautiful works of art just for people to drive by and enjoy them. I love it. Great energy at Fort Wilderness. Always have a good time. Um, if you are familiar with our channel, Kim has been missing this whole trip. Um, she is in the West Coast, Florida, spending time with her girlfriend. So I he came here with my friends, I had a great time. Thank you so much, Christina and Scott. Shout out to you both. Um, but I, I had a great weekend. So if you enjoyed this video, please hit your like button. Um, hit your notification bell so you'll be notified of all of our future content. And if you have not subscribed, please subscribe. We would really appreciate it. And I will see you in the next episode. Bye, guys.